It's Vampire Survivor's time, and I'm skipping past Ghost because it is Ghost to Shapeshifter Nino on Astral Stair. Oh no. Well, this is going to be a long, terrible set of stuff for me. Uh, I think a mount technically works. Wait, why'd I change? Ah, Toronus box is necessary. Right, I didn't hit these. Right, he keeps dropping parts. It's other characters that have a problem with on uh, just or just Venton. He just heals like mad. Oh, I can't destroy light sources with this, can I? Well, if I can, it's pretty... Okay, there's no need to get Spellbinder, because just the way it works. Oh, wait. Huh. So if I pop off my element, it switches to something else. Heck, I shouldn't even have gotten Candle Arbor to work. Hmm. Should have gone Sarabande. Yeah, the healing isn't much, but it's better than nothing. And if I get Pumroll, it improves. Oh, there's my mini shapeshifter. Totally what I was waiting for, and not just me forgetting again. Crown. Huh, I have a ton of health. Is that normal? Oh, I gain health when I get these, huh? Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that. Well, I've only played this character literally once, so it's not a surprise. It means he has an incredible synergy with Divine Bloodline. Uh oh. Well, they're coming at a decent clip now, at least. Yay, explosions. And many shapeshifter is keeping me somewhat safe. There's kind of really only so much that can be done. Oh, lucky NFT. I should go to an area where I'm not against the wall. That way all the spare parts keep coming into me. No, not the paintings. Yeah, they get instantly destroyed, but... Yeah, this is a pretty terrible weapon for this. Like, absolutely bad, terrible. Silver finger. Not likely to get much higher than that here. Crown. Frankly, should have gotten crown much earlier. What the game killer? What are you doing here, game killer? No, wait, you're the stage poltergeist. Or is it the pictures that are the poltergeist? Ah, I forget. Oh, there's the eight. Now we just gotta avoid that chest there. Because it will 100% screw me over if I grab it. I know it will. Now I can. Yep, Sirbande. Oh, nice little punch out there. Oh, right. I have to hold out. And of course I have to move. 
Oh, right. Do they get slowed when they go in the area of effect? Wait, I'm... Oh, I'm not invincible in that form. Oh, it's the... dead... model. That's being thrown around. That was like some weird foot thing. But nope, that's the lower half with the bones sticking out. Only one bone. Kind of odd. I guess I'm stacking so many that they're overlapping and they can't get in because they're only being brought in through the just venting. What a strange way to do this. Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm in much danger. Well, except when that happens, of course. Gotta hold out for on just ejection. Then it's just victory time. Yeah, I am taking some damage. I'm not sure what, since it's not playing the damage animation. Oh. Yay, clearance. Yeah, if they get near me, they just get sucked in the endless venting. Can't really do all that much. Oh, wow. They're not even dropping XP anymore, so that means once I grab that vacuum, I'm gonna shoot up in levels. What is with all the dang Starburst here? It's crazy, that's the third one. It's still going! Oh, that's the red gem. Holy crap. Let's be the chest I need. There we go. Oh, right. I think Spellbinder affects it. What the heck is this? Literally going so long. Oh, this is actually problematic. Uh, what the heck would I even need? Actually, Disco Gold wouldn't be terrible. Yeah. Huh. It's actually got anti-synergy. That's so odd. And strangely. Well, there are maybe a billion chickens around. I can't exactly... billion healing things. I can't exactly grab them. doesn't do damage. Oh, there it goes. Just does no damage. Oh, that's... flavorful. Okay, yeah, I know I wanted to say it, but A, this does no damage, apparently, and I didn't know that, and B, bone. Well, that's what basically what Mini Shapeshifter does by default, so... I can prevent them from getting in on me. 
heck, even the celestial egg has to get taken out by it. Oh man, there's just gonna end up being so many. They might just push their way in through that. At least I'm out of range of it. That's good. What a strange way to win. I don't think the bones are really doing anything here. Well, not like I have a better option than just hiding like a coward I am. Oh my god. Again, seriously. Oops. There we go. Those are the levels I was looking for for so dang long. No, get away from me. Oh, I almost have enough to break through, huh? Actually, even the regular celestial, or even the final celestial egg wave won't be able to get to me. Huh. What a strange, strange victory sits situation. Oh my god. How many is that? Seven? Yep, bye-bye Celestial Eggs, you can't hit me. That's a nice counter. Huh. Wait, are they... Is there like an instant kill effect that isn't getting tagged correctly or something? Wow, that was bright. That is incredibly bright. Yeah, there must be some sort of instant kill effect because the eggs kept spawning in like that. No death. Get in the vacuum. Oops. Hmm. I'm just gonna try just vent on the second one. Oh, that's your first eggs, isn't it? Tiny bridge in time. Pumrola is fine. Ken Arbador is good. Serpande for healing. Crown for leveling. Crown for leveling. Mini. Man, it would be helpful if that stuff got pushed in bounds. Never gonna need Spellbinder to keep it on the field longer. Unless Duplicator does something with it. That cursed Starburst. Bonus box, my area.
needed to start hitting the dudes as soon as it possibly can. Take them out of the fight. Let's use up some rerolls for that. Not evolving it, like I said. It's probably better here anyway, because boy, is it going to be super dangerous if you try it. Hmm, it actually goes outside the bounds. Yeah, even the super hardy Molises get pulled in. These don't, because they have some sort of Set. Yeah, without something to slow them down, like, well, plenty of other abilities. Crown the shapeshifter the king, like that one comic you've totally seen. Why did I die? And right before I grabbed awake, too. Okay, maximum event uses. I guess I could have grabbed beginning too, huh? Oh man, Bone was so carrying me. Oh, bye bye, Trona Box. Hey, healing. Well, not Bone, but Mini Shapeshifter. Yep. Oh, I just gotta avoid any chests so I don't evolve it. Oh, I'm really good at taking out boss enemies. Why doesn't let you vacuum in the parts? That is really kind of dangerous. Boy, this is not going well. All right, they're always frozen. Like not debuff frozen, but they were just standing still for some reason. Man, this is not good. I have to go for 20 minutes. And with 332 HP and it's still very dicey about survival. Stay away from me chest. I want none of your ch ch chainery. Second Arcana. Yeah, if I could just break out. Huh. How long do I get to stay in this form? Is it? Duration based. 
This is weird. Wait, why did they get punched through the freeze so fast? And even with a maximized cooldown. Of course, of course there's a starburst going off. Every dang time. Actually crazy how bad it gets. Starburst after starburst after starburst. It'd be really helpful if these dang health things got in my in lane. Let me out. Break out and collect them and be fine. There we go. Now that I have an area to play in. Who knew that crippling one of the characters' strongest moves would make him weak? doing much damage. Wait. Huh. So why, how does it gain more health? Because it totally was gaining it more health for a lot. No. Oh. Uh, didn't want to do that. Not supposed to spawn that deep on the tiny bridge, so that's why it's like this. Bloody starburst. I suppose I've been just venting. Ow, my eyeball! What an unjust ejection from YouTube. YouTube! Oh, hey, by the way, I got up to 50 subscribers, so thanks to everyone who subscribed to get me up to 50. It's just the first of the well, not first. The first milestone was one, and then five, ten, probably twenty-five, and death. Wow, 6.1 million exactly on both of them. That's funny.